Alright, so the Philippines recently won Miss Universe, which means once again, the Philippines is an international spotlight. And how many of you Filipinos out there have gotten these questions? Like, are Filipinos Asian? Are Filipinos Hispanic? Are Filipinos Pacific Islanders? Short answer, yes, yes, and yes. The long answer, uh, that's a little tricky. This is where it gets a little complicated. So first, are Filipinos Asian? Honestly, I'm surprised that we still get this question. The Philippines has officially been listed as an Asian country since forever, I feel like, since the beginning of time? I don't know. Well, there's two big reasons people cite Filipinos for not being Asian. One, our connection to the West, and two, the country's religion. Yes, the Philippines was Spanish and US occupied, and well, because of that Spanish occupation, the country is mostly Catholic. So I'm gonna break this down geographically, ethnically, culturally, and linguistically. So take a look at Taiwan, which is the closest country to Philippines. We are 100 miles from Taiwan. You could literally swim from Itbayat to Orchid Island. We're also 400 miles from mainland China. In, in fact, we're closer to China than Japan is. So the Filipinos that you see every day, like me and your friend, are not how the original Filipinos actually look like. So this is an Aboriginal Filipino, and because of their separation from the rest of society and the rest of the country, their lineage has been mostly untouched by Spanish, Chinese, and other visitors, so they would most accurately represent how the original Filipino would look like. So the Filipinos you see every day, like me, movies, TVs, your coworker that's really good at karaoke, your male friend that really likes K-pop. <laughs> were the results of generation and generations of mixing, uh, mainly Spanish, Chinese, and Indonesian. So one of the most popular theories is called the Out of Taiwan Theory, which was popularized by an Australian anthropologist by the name of Peter Bellwood. It states that the first settlers of the Philippines came from Taiwan and China around 4000 BC, which means that Filipinos and Chinese share the same ancestors. So if you go back far enough, I'm sure most Filipinos can trace their lineage all the way back to China. And since sea migration has become viable, the Philippines has always been a destination for Indonesian, Chinese, and other Asian immigrants. So Filipino culture and their traditions are in line with a lot of other Asian countries. We have the same kind of values. We teach, you know, high respect for elders, thriftiness. Um, we celebrate the same festivals and traditions. We even take our shoes off before we enter the house. How Asian is that? And another point, <laughs> food. I mean, look at this. We have very similar cuisines. We eat rice, egg rolls, rice desserts. We have plenty of noodles, shou pao, tofu, and I mean, pretty much everyone drinks boba. If that isn't evidence enough, I don't know what is. So Tagalog is an Austronesian language, which means it has the same similarities and it has the same roots as a lot of other Asian countries like Japanese, Malay, and Sundanese. And in addition to that, a lot of Tagalog is derived from Chinese Mandarin and Chinese Hokkien, which is a Southern Chinese language. In Tagalog, tea is Ta'a. In Mandarin, it's cha. Gold is ginto. In Mandarin, it's jing tiao. Soy sauce is toyo. In Hokkien, it's tao yu. In Tagalog, ki is susi. In Hokkien, it's so xi. Earring is hikao. In Hokkien, it's hikao. So, by all accounts, geographically, ethnically, culturally, linguistically, Filipinos are Asian, without a doubt. Anyone who says otherwise, I don't know, probably hates Filipinos. Hispanic refers to the people, nations, and cultures that have a historical link to the Spanish language or country of Spain. But more commonly, it applies to the countries once under colonial possession by the Spanish Empire. Spain occupied the Philippines for a really, really, really long time. Usually the first country when you think of the word Hispanic is Mexico but never the Philippines. Why is that? So if we go back, Spain occupied Mexico from 1521 to 1821, which is exactly 300 years. 
However, on March 31st, 1521, a man named Ferdinand Magellan suddenly planted a cross on the summit of a hill overlooking the sea and claimed for the king of Spain possession of all the islands he had seen. Which, officially and by records, marked the beginning of the Spanish colonization of the Philippines. However, Magellan died only a month later, so a lot of people like to cite February 13, 1565, which was when Miguel Lopez de Legazpi conquered Cebu. Then, on June 12, 1898, the Philippines issued their Declaration of Independence from Spain. That's 377 years, or 333 years if you go by a second date. Spain occupied the Philippines longer than Mexico. I mean, if anything, Filipinos are more Hispanic than Mexicans. That was a joke. Don't hurt me, por favor. I mean, just look at our last names. Cruz, Perez, Lopez, Hernandez, Garcia, Santos, Sanchez. You can't get any more Hispanic than that. With almost 400 years of Spanish occupation, you can be sure there was a lot of Spanish-Filipino mixing and intermarrying. Now, whether this was by choice of the Filipino or not is irrelevant, but because of how inconsistent and unreliable Filipino records were in the 1600s, there's not really any accurate number of how many Filipinos have Spanish ancestry. The numbers vary depending on which report you look at, but I've seen the number as high as 50% of Filipinos. Now, I doubt the number is actually that high, but it just gives you some perspective of how much Filipinos have Spanish ancestry. Linguistically, Spanish has been an official language of the Philippines since 1565. Aside from Spanish itself, Tagalog has heavy Spanish influence. In fact, 40% of all Tagalog words has their origin in Spanish and even uses Spanish outright. Tenedor. Tenedor. Cuchara. Cuchara. Cuchillo. Cuchillo. Zapatos. Zapatos. Medias. Medias. So yes, Filipinos are Hispanic. Are Filipinos Pacific Islander? This one's tricky. If you just want to go by the definition that a Pacific Islander is an inhabitant of an island in the Pacific, then yes, Filipinos do live on an island in the Pacific. But if you want to go deeper, Pacific Islander usually refers to the inhabitants of the islands of Micronesia, Melanesia, and Polynesia. And Filipinos have a strong connection with all of those groups. Here's a map of Micronesia. If you look at this, Davao is only 600 miles from Palau. And Palau was actually technically part of the Philippines back in 1885. So, according to the same theory I mentioned earlier, the first settlers of Micronesia actually came from the Philippines. As you can see on the map, migration started here in Taiwan, and then to the Philippines, and then from the Philippines, our ancestors migrated eastward about 2200 BC from Luzon to the Marianas Islands and Guam, and then later in 1000 BC from Mindanao to Palau, and later spread through the rest of Micronesia around 200 BC. And, being only 600 miles away, continual migration was shared between the Philippines and Micronesia, even until today, meaning modern Micronesian Filipinos would have the same ancestors. In fact, almost 40% of inhabitants in Northern Marianas, Guam, and Palau are ethnically Filipino, and an even bigger percentage have some sort of Filipino ancestry. It is theorized that the first settlers of Polynesia came from the Philippines and Taiwan, they then migrated south through Melanesia in 1300 BC, then later to Samoa in 800 BC, then to Tonga in 900 BC, and then to the rest of the islands in 700 AD. This would mean that modern Polynesians and Filipinos would have the same ancestors. Linguistically, the connection is also evident in the language. Take the word mata. In Tagalog, mata means eyes. And it's also the same in Samoan, Tongan, and Tahitian. Sky is langit in Tagalog. In Samoan, it's langi. Counting from 1 to 10 is basically the same in Cebuano and Samoan. In Cebuano. And in Samoan. It's usa. It's tasi. Duhat. Lua. Tulo. Tolu. Upat. Fa. Lima. Lima. Unom. Ono. Pito. Fitu. Walo. Valu. Siam. Iva. Og. Napulo. Sefulu. Actually, 
all the Filipino, Polynesian, Micronesian, and Melanesian languages are all classified as Austronesian languages because of their shared origin and their similarities. So, our Filipino's Pacific Islander, well, we definitely have shared ancestry, but it depends on your definition and who you ask. Since the definition clearly states Polynesian, Melanesian, and Micronesian, I don't know, maybe you decide. To summarize, our Filipino's Pacific Islander it depends on your definition, once again. Are Filipinos Hispanic? Yes. Are Filipinos Asian? 1,000, 1 million percent yes. Don't let anyone else tell you otherwise. I hope this cleared things up. If you liked what you saw, hit subscribe, follow my Instagram, and I'll see you next time.